14. He's ranked number one in the world. But really, it's not so incredible when you consider the kid has been on skis for 13 and a half years. Oh, yeah, I grew up with a skiing family, the Boniface. They got into skiing when, uh, when it first started, Dick Pope Jr. They opened Cypress Gardens in 1943. I was six months, 29 days old when I started skiing. And my mom and my dad taught me how to ski. I know I couldn't walk, so, but you don't need to walk to ski. Yeah, I'm 14 years old and I'm in the eighth grade. I'm going into ninth because I'm on summer right now. Traveling around is just unreal. I love doing it. It's my first year traveling around on tour. It's Zane Schwank. I'm staying with him. Jeremy Kovac, Scott Hussey. I'm staying with all these guys right now. They're, 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 they're the coolest skateboarders that you can ever meet. It doesn't matter what my age is. I'm just like them. Everybody's a human being, so. You want to hear him giggle like a girl? No, please. Giggle with a little girl. <laughs> this is what I have to put up with every day. <laughs> the guy is 14, and he's scoring more women than this 21 year old. <laughs> what? I would never top dog like him. If he gets any better, I will have to break his legs. I'm ready to break his legs right now. I hope there's no pressure on them because they didn't put any pressure on me when I first started. So, you know, ski good, ski good, and have fun, have fun. And they were only kidding about the scoring women thing. <laughs> By the way, you know, he's only been wakeboarding for two years, but he makes it look so effortless. He gets more air than anyone, sometimes 20 feet. And it might be because he's just so light. He hangs on and just flies. Yeah, he gets huge air. You can tell. The other wakeboarders get along with him well from, from that piece there. They don't question his tricks, but they were questioning last night how he'd handle the pressure. He admitted that for the first time in his short life, he felt pressure here at the X Games as one of the favorites. So the wakeboarding world was waiting to see how he might handle the pressure in the final. Let's go to Doug Dunbar, Dave Benzel, and Camille Duvall at Roger Williams Park.